Ladies and gentlemen, we're back to finally conclude today's discussion po at mga guests ko, mga Taga Clark Investors and Locators Association. And uh, you will see this through the mga changes, changes, change in the culture, change in the way things are being done. Uh, dito sa CDC, uh, Mr. President. I think the fact that he's at the top of the helm, eh, mm. medyo meron talaga siya the power to do that. Um, he will find uh, what do you call this? Yung opposition at the start. Pero once they get the ano, get used to it, get used to it, or oh, chakamang hitan lang ano niya, yung kanyang intention. I think people will just follow. Uh, for one thing, the locators are going to be supportive definitely, kasi nakikitan lang ano yung yung what in his intentions are. All right. So mm -hmm. ano yan? Susunod din yan. Susunod na yan, no? At uh, magigita naman natin na uh, I can see from you na talagang very supportive naman yung sila. Dito sa mga policies yeah. na uh, ini-introduce ni President Tugade, no? Yeah. Oo. Hmm. Ano lang yan, eh. Kung maga, ano yan, eh. Parang uh, two-way street. Oh, eh. tama. So, hmm. we see that uh, he's very supportive. Instantly, ano kami, di ba? Parang, right. uh, ano kami, hmm. parang. Oh, Mr. Lito. Actually, uh, as I've always mentioned, no, yung, uh, what is good to uh, the locators, no? Uh, it's also good to see DC. <laughs> so, mm -hmm. Of course. Mm -hmm. yeah, uh, And he knows that. Alam niyo yeah. Uh, uh, o nga pala, yung uh, impact din niya, uh, yung uh, matunog ngayon, yung good governance na pinapasok niya as a culture ngayon sa CDC, no? During the break, we were discussing ano yung mga changes na ginawa niya na bawal tumanggap ng regalo. Hindi lang ho yung sinasabi niya. And we've heard yung mga binigay na gifts during the Christmas uh, break, uh, hindi niya tinanggap at hindi niya Uh, pinaka, na, hindi siya nakinabang doon. Ang ginawa niya, ba't nabalita namin, pinarapaw niya. Mm -hmm. ba diba? Kasi uh, the only way for you to lead is to set an example. Eh. Yes. Ginagawa niya ngayon dyan. Meron kang kinukwento kanina, uh, Director Lito, yung uh, nagbabayad sa... Ah, yes, actually, may uh, awareness na sa kanila, sa mga ideado. No? Uh, there is one uh, employee from their uh, finance department So, yung nag-handle ng payment sa PLDT. So, nag-file siya, dahil siya palagi ang uh, frequent uh, uh, ano, na nag-file sa PLDT. So, binibigyan siya ng payong ano, at saka directory. Eh, kayo namimigay kayo talaga tal kayo. Corporate giveaway. Oh. So, oh. Uh, hindi niya tinanggap. Ang <laughs> mabalitaan, sabi niya, mahirap na, sabi niya. <laughs> so, isipin mo yung culture na siniset niya. Yeah. No? If you're an investor or you're just becoming an investor, pag nabalitaan mo po, bawal ang regalo. I, I, I think uh, the, the people are following suit, no? Sinusunod yung mga sinasabi niya because they know it's not mere lip service, no? Uh, he, he, they know uh, it's, he means business and uh, he wants this to really happen, no? Kasi tinanong siya, anong, ano, ano ang programa niyo dito? Culture, 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 yan. Uh, meaning, uh, after you work with me, you, 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 you will do better, sabi. Ano naman ang pinagmamalaki niya sa mga... Officers, at saka mga empleyado ng Clark Development Corporation. I think based on experience uh, mm -hmm. with my working with him for several years before. Parang pinagtugma kayo, no? Maano ka talaga, eh. Hindi, talagang marami kang matututunan. Oh, mm -hmm. Kung baga, you'll come out in the business world better prepared mm -hmm. if you go with, go through him, I should yes. say. Mm -hmm. no? Sabi ko nga, terror dati yan, eh. Kailangan handa ka pag nakaharap mo yan. <laughs> Kailangan na... Uh, professor na terror, ha? <laughs> Oo, oh, oh, ganun. Yung, uh, Pero medyo ganun pa rin yata yung perception, ha? Oo, oh, naman. Uh, oh. Pero at least, ano, ngayon sa government siya, I think it's doing a lot of good. As I mentioned during the break din, di ba, sabi ko, uh, during his time in the business uh, world, galante yan. Mm -hmm. Pero, kasi ano yun, eh. Uh, pera ng kumpanya yun eh. Pero yes. ngayon, pera ng gobyerno is the money of the people eh. So, oh, mm -hmm. hindi niya, hindi niya, na, ano, oh, eh, di ba? Binabantay niya ng husto, ayaw niya ng, mm -hmm. ano, meron mga tama ganyan. Mm -hmm. Ilalabas mo yung mga tao, ilalabas ka ng mga tao, parang ganyan, magkaka-favors kasi. Mm -hmm. Kailangan talaga, ano, uh, magpakita siya ng example na what he wants the rest to do. And then I think every, everything will just... Eh, paano uh, naman sa side? Sabi mo kanina, naintindihan din naman ng, ng business side ang, ang gusto niya mangyari. Will there, will there be changes also from the ranks ng, ng SILA on the way things are being done? Uh, what do you mean? In terms of... Hindi uh, na sila masyadong maglalabas? <laughs> <laughs> well, I think, ano, after they've uh, seen that ganito nga ang ano niya, uh, way of ano niya, mm -hmm. governing, 
baka hindi na magta-try. Oh. <laughs> diba? <laughs> oh, even sa kanya, no? Oh, uh, ano na lang, everything the 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 legal way, everything yes. is ano, mm-hmm. parang transparent. Yung proseso, ganyan. So, tamang proseso. Oh, yeah. tamang proseso lalo na ang intention niya naman talaga is to facilitate things para mabilis, efficient. Mm-hmm. Di ano na, pantay-pantay na, di ba? Oh. Maganda 'yon. Kasi sabi naman niya yung tweet na daw na policy ng ni Pangulong Pinoy. Hindi lip service yun, ganyan eh. Uh, talagang po- policy yun. And I, I think he's, uh, he's really uh, making that happen here. No? Yeah, because uh, what uh, Pinoy has done also has also yes. reflected in the economy. In di the ba? global at uh, national oh, economy, oh, yeah. di ba? Mm-hmm. So, so when things are this, like this are happening, meaning good governance, uh, yung businessman gustong mag-invest, di ba? Oh. Dadami yan. Oh. Okay, we have a few minutes left. Uh, Uh, Mr. Director, baka meron kang gustong idagdag sa napag-usapan na natin. Actually, uh, uh, yung uh, good governance na sinasabi ni Chairman, uh, mm-hmm. uh, uh, talagang magiging a part ng attraction ng Clark. No? Uh, ko- kasi yung Clark hindi lang nakikipag-compete dito but sa mga ibang uh, bansa. sa ibang bansa. No? So, uh, dapat talaga, kasi pagtitingnan mo, ano bang magiging advantage ano bang advantage ng Clark? Why, why I will uh, put my money in Clark? So, dapat talaga, ang, ang talagang pwede nating i- i-emphasize dyan yung uh, good governance at saka yung security. Mm-hmm. No? Dahil uh, yan ang compared to other economic zone dito. Na, ano, mm-hmm. Kasi uh, sa mga in terms of uh, incentives, uh, mga benefits, uh, wala namang difference. Eh. Mm-hmm. So, yun lang dalawa na yun ang nakikita ko. Na, yun lang dalawang factors yeah. na yun. Ayos na. Ayos na yun. Okay. okay. So, uh, Mr. Captain Abad. Uh, sa akin, sa nakikita ko kay President Tugade, leadership by example siya. Mm. So, uh, of course, there, there's uh, always uh, yung mga resistance to change. Mm-hmm. Pero, uh, ano din yan? Masasana din yan as they go on. Yes. Kasi nga, siyempre, uh, because of so many years na nangyayar na puro ganun lang, mm-hmm. and na-shock sila at biglang babaguhin yung, yung sistema ng not only on their uh, yung kanilang uh, ugali sa trabaho towards uh, the clients but uh, lahat pati yung pagpasok nila dapat pumasok ka na sa oras pero in complete uh, even, uniform even the vice presidents yung members ng mancom ah, nag nagano uh, sila ng kanilang mga benefits no yeah, oh. uh, voluntarily surrendered their benefits no yes so talagang kasi ang nakikita ko sa kanya cut costs and then increase the revenues no? yes and oh. i think uh, that's the way you like it oh kasi <laughs> Napansin niya siguro na waste of money uh, from mm-hmm. the government. So, uh, I think uh, uh, that's the best step that uh, he has done. Naglalakad nga eh from his office to the canteen. Oo nga. Kaya nga sabi ko sa'yo, <laughs> leadership by example. Nga, sabi, para, <laughs> gagawin ko, kailangan gawin nyo rin. Parang ganun yung mm-hmm. kanya eh. So, kung magagawa ko, bakit kayo hindi nyo kayang gawin? Right. Parang ganun, di ba? So, uh, I think uh, that's the best uh, step that he has done. Uh, ang sila naman eh, fully supportive sa kanya. Okay. And... And I'm sure he'll be yes. happy about that. No? Yes. Uh, Mr. Chairman, Chairman, uh, full name, Nino Enriquez, ha? Okay. Baka hindi nila matanda, di ba? Hindi pa si Enriquez na matanda. Ano, 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 pangalan ulit? Nino Enriquez. Wala ka bang kaninyo? Meron talaga yun. Oo, hindi, wala kang kaninyo sa mga ibang, ano? Kandidato? Oo. Wala. Okay. Kaya nga pag yung slogan, Abogado Nino, talaga hong nyo yun. Di ba? Okay. So anyway, ang ano natin ngayon is, napapansin ho namin yun, Mr. President, kung ano yung ginagawa nyo ngayon sa CDC. Uh, maliban lang ho doon sa mga nasabi namin, eh, uh, hindi pa ho namin nasabi, yung presence ngayon ng mga CDC police. Very evident kayon dahil doon sa nakaraan na panahon na uh, may incidents of uh, lapse in security. No? Hindi ka nice-nice. Oh, kaninang umaga nga lang, nakita ko, apat na uh, naka-green shirt, uh, anim na white shirt, mismo nasa main gate. Mm-hmm. Diba? At nakikita kong umuikot ngayon talaga yung mga mobile patrol. Mm-hmm. So kung titignan ko nyo, kami ho, nadidinig namin, nadidinig din namin yung nangyayari ngayon na yung mga services ho ng CDC, sinusole sa mot- uh, motor pool at the end of the day. So kukunin at the beginning of the day, the following day, at hindi ho pwede iuwi ngayon sa uh, kanilang bahay. So uh, huwag kayong mag Mr. President, kami ay nandito at pinapansin ho namin yan. 
Thank you. Uh, chairman, ah, ngayon si Mr. President. Ah, okay. Yung ano ko, mga sasabihin ko hindi entirely related. But the fact that uh, the CDC President is supportive and uh, SIAC as well is... Uh, uh, these people know each other, so maganda yung ano nila, tandem, si Papano. Um, I wanted to mention what one SILA project is the the Clark Aviation Conference, which is yes, late very soon. February 21. So uh, this is going to highlight Clark as a po possible future aviation hub and an aerotropolis. So... Um, we want to invite everyone to attend this. We were, it's a private sector driven, so magandang project ito. Um, we want to show to the world, starting from the government, the Philippine government, what Clark is able to do, the, the, the potential of Clark, and what we hope it will become in mm -hmm. a few years. So this will be in Feb 21. Um, as I mentioned, with the, the tandem of the new CDC president, the old SIAC president and SILA, I think uh, this will be very successful. So, okay, guys, much. thank you very much. Huh? Maraming maraming salamat. At uh, at least kahit hindi ko kayo pinagsasalita, kayo na nagsasalita ngayon. Ano ba yun? And we're happy about it. I, I've always... Uh, uh, oh, one yeah. thing lang, ano, uh, I think it is also worth to mention na marami naman sa P CDC na masisipag at uh, magagaling oh, uh, empleyado, no? And uh, they, they just need siguro a, a good leader to lead them, yeah, ano? Exactly. So. Hindi, tama nga yun eh, kasi pag iniba mo yung kultura, madali na maka-adjust yan dahil magagaling naman sila at may, merong angking talino, no? And uh, they'll get the message, I'm very sure about it. Anyway, thank you very much at uh, kami ho uh, ay masaya sapagkat napag-usapan ho namin ito at na, nakita ho namin na ating pong mga uh, kasalukuyang mga, at siguro even those uh, uh, other officials of uh, Clark Investors and Locators Association, they're bullish. Ah, masasabi natin bullish tayo sa mga darating na panahon because things are really happening now and uh, things are being made easier for them and when things are easy for them and they themselves talk about it, then more locators will be expected. And what, anong ibig sabihin yan? When more locators are here, when more locators are coming, ang ibig kong sabihin yan ay mas maraming empleyo. Ang ibig sabihin yung mga nasa labas ho ay makikinabang yung mga businesses sa, sa labas ng uh, Clark uh, Freeport Zone ay makikinabang din. So, ang mangyayari ho dyan, everybody will be happy. So, with that message, uh, maraming maraming salamat po. At uh, muli po, no, we're gonna have the, them again in the near future to talk about their other plans and programs for the year. And we are there to support them. You have a nice day now. Ito po si Sandy Lopez sa inyong programang Aksyon Central Luzon Special Edition. <laughs>